are you feeling tonight? Oh, I feel, I feel miserable. I feel lonely. Sad. I feel unloved. You did kill Jersey. I. I'm not over here. I'm not over I did not. That cat was dying in the movie already. I did not kill the cat. I'm a major animal lover. I'm not having that abuse. We love you. Scott and I were saying, you're us. Like, I love your passion oh, thank for you. all of this. Yeah. We got to help you with your selfie. Okay, so the selfie I'm not game. Good at it. So the, I just have one. It's just one quick. Can we just one quick okay. for the selfie? All right. You want to get the camera, and yeah. when you see it, yeah. if it's blurry, you just want to give it a swipe. Just get the whatever's <laughs> in your pocket. Do you want to? You want a really crisp? See, we can get it like this. A really crisp. Let's get one. Let's get one. Here we go. Oh yeah. Oh, look how okay. handsome. Now how, now, how do we know that that's not blurry? Now watch. Bam. Yeah. And yeah. if you want to like get, you can get really get in there and you can give it a tap and it'll give it a focus. Okay. So can when you, you just take 50 years off me, so yes. I look like there's you. An you need it. There's an app. There's an app. But you got it. Yeah, but then people look like, you know, <laughs> they're weird. mutants. So weird. 47 years ago, you wrote a letter. To Barbara Streisand. She's I here. I she's here. Not, Has she arrived? Do we have a plan? Do we have a plan? Look, when I see her, we can pass on a message. Scott and me. What would, yeah. What do we say? You just tell Babs. I'm free and available. Oh. Okay? Yeah. I know she's married. I know I'm married, but I'm free and available. <laughs> My wife understands that. I don't know that Jim Brolin understands that. Mr. James Brolin understands that, but I understand that. She's your whole pack. Yeah. Cheers. Yeah. What would you do, honestly? Yeah. If she. Oh, my God, she's if here, she's Barbara. Like, oh, Barbara. Uh, <laughs> you're cruel. What would you you're do? You're cruel, you see. What would you do, honestly? I would probably levitate. Yeah. Like David Blaine. This mean you're a huge Stars Born fan? Yeah, huge, huge Stars Born fan. Yeah. Have you seen Gaga and Cooper? Yes, I've seen Gaga and I had, I had dinner with Gaga two nights ago. You had, oh, yeah, like, it was a nominee's dinner. Twelve of us. And? Uh, it wasn't, you mean it was a one to one? No, we were sitting next to each other. She was great. Yeah. And? Are we getting liquored up? Are we partying? What are we doing? Well, you're speaking to somebody who's allergic to alcohol. So Definitely no. not you. But she sang. She sang. There what? was like a bunch of people there, all the. Uh, Oscar nominees, the musicians were there, and the actors were there. And there was a jam session afterwards, led by Herbie Hancock. You know, what? This is you're incredible. too young to know who that is. I know who Herbie Hancock. Were you just? This bird that's, is that's, old. That's, that's and like we were in Betty Davis's old house. How's that? Yeah. How's that? I got her eyes. Good lord. <laughs> yeah. Good lord indeed. Yeah. Pinch me, mom. We are oh, doing yeah. a little thing called the challenge. Yes. Where we're challenge. singing a little shallow. Gaga. Tell me something. Well, I am completely tone deaf. Tell me something, girl. Are you happy in this modern world, or do you need more? Is there something else you're searching for? Richard, <laughs> you know, I'm with in. With that accent, I, it's a winner. It it's still a winner. It totally worked for me. I don't know. Okay. <laughs>